I'm with the American Friends Service Committee here in Vermont. And I just wanted to say that I had an opportunity recently in a radio show that I have weekly to interview a Boston Globe national security reporter. His name is Brian Bender. And he was talking about the, def the def Business Defense Board, which is a board put together by uh, then the, the um, Secretary of Defense Donald Rumsfeld in 2001 when he was looking to reshape the U.S. military. And what this Business Defense Board, which is composed of heads of corporations, including several of the corporations that Students Against War have talked about, what they have uh, recommended to the Pentagon, to the, well, actually to the incoming president, this is what their, their message was, was that several weapon systems be uh, eliminated because uh, they are not doing what they're supposed to do. Um, they, he cited, uh, Mr. Bender from the Boston Globe, cited studies by the, the General Accounting Office, the Inspector General of the Department of Defense, and about how these cost overruns are costing the U.S. taxpayers hundreds of millions of dollars, billions of dollars, and in fact, they're not getting the weapon systems that they're, we are paying for, that these corporations are in effect ripping off the American people and making American security even less than it was. I ask you to take a look at the uh, website of the Center for Defense Information, which is an organization of former generals and U.S. admirals who are looking at U.S. military spending. And they are pointing out that hundreds of billions of dollars of U.S. taxpayer money is being lost to these corporations because of the abuses that these students have so beautifully documented. So I urge you not only to divest because it is the right thing to do, because we should not be tying our economy to war, because that only gives us an incentive to go to more war. But I also ask you to do it because it's a bad investment. Thank you.